this is what this sport is all about. means means everything for me you know it means a, a dream come come true for me for my family that's what I want I want to uh, give a better life for my family and for myself for me it's just the start after all my fights in FC I'm treated uh, I'm treated very very well here in Salvador you know People recognize me on the streets all the time. Actually, it's an amazing thing for me, you know. When people recognize me, especially kids, I feel proud of myself, you know. Because, man, I don't know, it's a life. I come from a small city, a humble family. So it's, everything is huge for me, you know. I grew up in Caçador, Santa Catarina. It's a small city here in Brazil. And the life was very hard for sure because as my mom used to work like uh, cleaning the houses and factories around there. And she didn't make too much money to pay for the food, you know. I, I used to cry a lot, you know. I was a weak, weak kid, you know, in the school. And if I had, you know, in my, in my whole life, if I had three fights on the street, it was, was not too much. And for sure, in two of them, I got beat. <laughs> the Brazilian people, they are fighters, you know. They fight for their life. Uh, everything is hard, I think. For me, it was, you know. Everything is hard in here in Brazil. And I think it's things like that make me uh, a man before I, I be a man. You know? I started training uh, to lift weights in a gym here, and, and that time I, I, I was watching Pride fights and Minotauro Nogueira and Vanderlei. So when I see at the gym where I lift weights, they got a jiu-jitsu class. So I started training and I learned everything very fast. After one year and some months, I did my first MMA fight. My fight number six, I think so, here in Brazil. My manager, he said, well, I got one more fight here in Brazil. And he said, after this fight, I can get a fight for you in UFC. But to fight against the number one contender for the title in that time, Fabrício Verdun. Uh, when they told me that, I stayed very nervous, you know, because I used to watch Fabrício's fight in TV. And now I got a fight against him. Oh, there he goes, and it is over! A huge uppercut, and Dos Santos is the victor! Wow! Huge, huge victory for Junior Dos Santos! Sometimes people think uh, when I, because I'm, I'm laughing and joking all the time with people, because I'm a happy guy, they think I don't, don't take my career very serious, I don't take my fights, I don't take my life very serious, you know? I like to be nice, you know, but when I get in the cage, that's very important, you know, that's my life. So I take that very, very serious, and I look to my opponent, and I, I start to think just about him, you know. What are you going to do to beat him, and then if he do something, what are you going to do to defend that? Oh, oh Dos Santos is that's it. it up! Everything was, uh, happens very, very fast in my career. Uh, I started training five years ago. I gave my 100% of me, and now I think I deserve to be here. Oh, wow. UFC has changed my whole life, and I think I did pretty well. <laughs> Junior, no shot.